How's everybody doing today? My name is Zach. Today we're going to talk about your shoulder plane. A really important concept in being consistent and keeping your hands and arms traveling on the correct plane line. Okay, so at address you notice I bend over from my hips. Uh, typically we bend till our spine and our shaft are roughly at about a 90 degree angle. Okay, and why that's important there is you're going to notice from there my shoulders turn at a 90 degree angle to my spine at all points of the golf swing. On the way back and on the way down, through, and up to your finish. Okay, people that struggle with coming over the top, you can see from there their shoulder turn is too, too flat. Uh, people that in their backswing, they raise their shoulders up and come out of their posture. Their shoulder turn is also too flat. So you can see here, it, in, in being consistent, you're going to notice my shoulders are always working at a right angle to my spine. On the way back, and on the way through the shot. So, a drill you can do to help work with that is grab your club, hold it at a dress out in front of you. You notice my arms are pretty straight, and from here I'm going to pivot into my backswing, and you notice that my shoulder plane and the shaft pretty much match up. From here as I go back, my left arm is pretty close to my chest. My right arm has moved up and away from me. So here's the backswing. Now from here my weight shifts forward, and we work through the ball. Notice my right shoulder is pointing down now, right? My right elbow is into my side, and my left arm has a little space in my follow-through. So real, real, real quick, once again, backswing, follow-through. And you just go back and forth, getting the sense of your shoulders working on the proper plane. So this is what it looks like hitting a shot. that a try and see if that doesn't help you be more consistent.